Okay, I think my dog's in the picture kind of, but that's okay. Okay, he's just gonna sit right there. Do you see my... His name's Sirius Black because I'm cool. <laughs> okay, I should be in frame. I don't know if he's gonna stop growling because he's very interested in what the neighbors are doing. Oh, wait. Oh, sh I was like, there's police at my house, but my neighbor's a police officer. Jesus. So that makes sense that there's police there because he's... You get it. I'm just gonna do a super quick review of Legend by Mary Lou, um, which is pretty old. I'm sure pretty much everyone's read it except me, but I finally read it and I had like a few thoughts on it, so I just wanted to go into it. This is gonna be a spoiler-free review because I think those are the best, because aren't you gonna read a review or watch a review usually just to see if you should even pick up the book, right? That's my thought process, but maybe I'm wrong, so who knows? Let me know. And it does even, I mean, it's spoiler-free, but like hasn't everyone read this, so is that maybe like silly? I don't know. Anyways, so, okay, so first I'll talk about... Oh, the plot and everything. Um, this is basically just YA dystopian. Um, it's pretty good. There are certain points in the writing where <laughs> it kind of is that thing where it's like, I'm gonna hint at like what's really going on, but it wasn't particularly subtle. So I was like, kind of, it was, they weren't moments that were awful, but they kind of took me out of the story and were kind of laughable in my mind. So that wasn't so great, but like it wasn't bad enough to where I was gonna like set it down and stop reading kind of thing. Uh, the characters were interesting. I liked the girl's character. What's her name? Shoot? Is it June? It is June. Okay, yeah. <laughs> the character June, I really liked her a lot. Um, I felt like her perspectives and her thought process processes were interesting and um, just she was sort of more unique as a female character I thought. And I like that a lot. Like, I guess sometimes I feel like when I'm reading, like, the badass female character in literature or even in movies, it oftentimes it feels like someone just took, like, a dude and made him, like, typical masculine traits. And then it's like, oh, but it's a girl and that's what makes her badass. But it's like, masculine traits aren't what make you badass. Like, just being badass makes you badass. And I felt like that was kind of conveyed in this book pretty well. The guy, Day, was also interesting, but... I guess I found him, there was like less depth to his character than I felt there was with June. Um, but even saying that, there was, I didn't, I f I'm curious to see if we get more out of their characters in the second and third book in the trilogy, which I am planning on reading. This book also has alternating viewpoints, which I liked a lot for this, the purpose of the story. I thought it worked well. It wasn't, again, like Allegiant, which I think did it really poorly. Like, this was interesting, it gave you interesting insights into the world. And the perspectives were different enough where it's like, oh, like, it served the purpose that it was supposed to. Uh, and it's also kind of fun. The pages have, like, gold writing when it's day. And then when it's June, it's, like, the boring regular writing. So, there's that. My only actual criticism of the book is the characters in this book are, like, 15, I think. Fif yeah, they're 15. And I'm like, I felt like that was like a smidge too young. It kind of took me out of the book a little bit, just as far as like the things that the two characters were doing. It was kind of like, oh, the pretty sophisticated for 15 year olds. And I think, I think this is a book where if they had aged up the characters, that wouldn't have taken away from anything. Like, it's not like in the Hunger Games where the whole point is it's supposed to be horrifying that like 12 year olds are killing each other. So the ages of all the characters make sense. Like this, they could have aged it up and it would have been totally fine and I wouldn't have been as kind of like when reading it. So that's probably my one complaint. Uh, I'm interested to read the second book. Probably gonna not get to it for a while just because I have so much else to read right now, but I'm glad I got this and read it. So yeah. He's so cute. Anyways. <laughs> I hope he's, are you even in frame? Thanks for watching. Uh, please like and subscribe if you wanna see more of my content and post like a comment letting me know what you thought about this. I'm sure everyone's read it a super long time ago, but like let me know your thoughts if you had any ever at any point. All right, yeah, so yeah, thanks for watching guys, bye. I wonder if any of that was in frame, what do you think? Oh, you're so cute.